After being resurrected, Jesus appeared to the disciples another time in the upstairs room. Remember that I told you multiple times while I was still with you. Everything written about me in the law of Moses, the writings of the prophets and the Psalms had to come true. Then he opened their minds to understand the scriptures and said to them, This is what is written. The Messiah must suffer and must rise from death three days later. And in his name, the message about repentance and the forgiveness of sins must be preached to all nations, beginning in Jerusalem. You have seen God's promises come true, you are my witnesses. And I myself will send upon you the Holy Spirit, which my Father has promised to you. But you must wait here in Jerusalem until the power from above comes down upon you. Then he led them out of the city along the road to Bethany. Why are we going to Bethany? Maybe we are visiting Lazarus and his sisters, Mary and Martha. Yes, please. Their food is great. When Jesus had led them out to the vicinity of Bethany, he lifted up his hands and blessed them. Go then, to all peoples everywhere and make them my disciples. Baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. And teach them to obey everything I have commanded you. And I will be with you always to the end of the age. As he was blessing them, he departed from them and was taken up into heaven. They worshipped him and went back into Jerusalem, filled with great joy. Yes, he is truly the savior of this world. God is so merciful. He is saving all who love him. Let's go. Tell everyone this good news. Have you heard? He will be with you always. Yes, come over here. Let's all gather in our room, waiting for that power from above to come, of which Jesus has spoken. <laughs>